2020 is finally over, guys. Yeah, give it up. Woo! I already forget what I named this dude, but uh, what's, what's a good name for one of these things? Um, Carl? So if you don't know, YouTube normally does a YouTube rewind every year. It's where they highlight all the popular stuff that happened on YouTube. They have a bunch of like big creators come and make cameos and things like that. But because of you know what, <coughs> they decided not to do it this year, which might not be seen as a bad thing because if you know, they're some of the most disliked videos on YouTube. But because they're not doing one this year, Mr. Beast decided to take it into his own hands and make his own YouTube Rewind this year. So I thought that I would watch it with you guys because no matter how much 2020 sucked, it shapes us as a society, it shapes us as individual people, and I think it's important to look back on everything that happened. I'm gonna try not to pause the video at all because you guys hated that last time I did reactions, so I'm gonna try to wait till the end to do that, and then we can talk about stuff afterwards. And I'll link the video down below in case you wanna watch it without my commentary. What's up, YouTube? I think right. we can all agree Looks that like the Will 2020 Smith intro there. might be the only thing in existence worse than 2018 Rewind. Yeah. Dang, because that was 2018. Pandemic, it seems like, thousands of creators seems like it was just last year. Videos. It was brutal, and I can't blame YouTube for not wanting to make a Rewind, but a lot of good things still did Look at that duct tape down there. They just like duct taped the plexiglass to it. wouldn't be YouTube if we didn't have a nice. Rewind to make fun of, so enjoy. The film concerns about the deadly coronavirus officially hitting the U.S. Here's what Sports, PewDiePie, KSI, Fall Guys, Among Us, opening Pokemon card. Yes, you're beautiful. Mr. Beast Rewind! I've always thought that YouTubers should get more say in Rewind, which is why I called hundreds of YouTubers and asked them what they think should be in Rewind. What do you want in YouTube Rewind? What do I want in YouTube Rewind? Minecraft. This year was a big year for Minecraft. Minecraft. Huge. I love you. I would put a lot of Minecraft. The resurgence of Minecraft. James Charles. Minecraft. Your stupid chicken. Did he, of all the drama that happened this year, was that mine? Honest, honest. The coffee dance meme. It's too soon, Hikaru. Yeah. Valkyrie! Thank you so much for the support. So many amazing Twitch games streamer. came out this year. Woo! Susan would just be doing one pick play. I actually really like this person. Dream. Dream. Oh yeah, Dream, Dream speedrunning a lot of drama there. I have a strange feeling that Dream will be left out of YouTube Rewind. What Dreams are doing is crazy. No! No! no There's no way! Yes! I gotta say, losing to Ninja in Rock, Paper, Scissors, absolute the lowest point in 2020. Easy! Oh, Bro, look at that. Ooh. It looks just like me. We were doing Among Us in real life. Yeah. Something with Among Us? Among Us is huge. Among Us. Among For sure. Among Us. I love how Graham Among Stephens Among in here Among over us. there. Like, he's like moments. totally out of place compared no, to his other no, people. No. But I do love Graham. Corpse husband. Corpse husband. Corpse is Corpse husband. Corpse husband. Corpse. His voice, he makes my arm hair stick up. I've been waiting so long for this. Dude, it's like, Jacksepticeye raised <laughs> I love his voice, man. Plus dollars well, check out his music if you haven't. Matt had raised over $3 million. Yeah. For, there was a lot of charity effort. I feel like as a whole, yeah. the community really banded together. The YouTubers Yeah, I think there's a lot of good things that happen. Brand of the car. B L N. Black Lives Matter. We have to spread the message. Yeah. We have to be responsible and use our voices. This is our time. Hey, bro, this is the human race. Logan, congratulations on not having a major controversy <laughs> yeah. this year. Good I job. I don't want to say the thing. Don't make me say the thing. I would definitely nice. go Black Pink in Best part of this whole thing. Mark Rober Black teaching Pink? squirrels Love them. to Paco. All of Mark Rober's videos. I made friends with a bunch of squirrels. The new PlayStation called PlayStation 5. Worst part of 2020. <laughs> the worst part about 2020 definitely was losing Kobe. Now, I think the definition yeah. of greatness is to inspire Speak for a lot of people. people next to you. Oh yeah, and the Jeopardy host. Oh yeah, Black Panther. The worst part of 2020 would probably be COVID-19. It's a bit of a virus going around. So say the first part, you can see all the good stuff that happened. Obviously bad stuff happened, but there was a good thing that happened. I guess just on the personal level, it's going to sacrifice at all of the healthcare workers and workers had to make money. David Dobrik quit YouTube and switched to TikTok. Definitely the coronavirus and the pandemic. I didn't get to see my boys all year. Oh yes, computer science class. I'm the hacker man. 
Mr. Beast. Mr. Beast. Mr. Beast. Mr. Beast winning creator of the year. Definitely Mr. Beast giving a million dollars worth of food. Didn't he like make burgers or something? Right. Karen and Dej. Toilet paper? I just want to Oh yeah, the, the whole grocery store is running out of freaking toilet paper. Hello <laughs> again, oh. Everyone to appear or change their look somehow. <laughs> that was good. I animated oh, yeah. Mr. Beast Me Canyon, dude. Me Canyon's awesome. Sorry about that, Jimmy. Jenna Marbles quitting YouTube is the biggest thing. On YouTube this year. She said she quit on YouTube's channel for now. I don't know. Lap? Wet? P word. The <laughs> boxing match. Nate Robinson versus Jake Paul. And he I don't watch hard. any of their really boxing matches, versus. to be honest. <laughs> Holy Wapsy. Anthony Padilla for giving voices to people. Gaming moments. I'm talking speed runs. Speed TikTok. TikTok. TikTokers to be kind. TikTok is just cringe. Okay, I have five very special friends. I was just The hot ones in there. A lot of stuff. A lot of stuff, yeah. I want to see what dream really looks. I want to see what corpse looks like. It's gonna be like a marshmallow cameo, or it's not even. Yeah. Same. What you currently see on your screen is every single channel that hit 10 million subscribers in 2020. Damn, not why am I not on that list, more than I what thought the it heck? Was. And what you see on your screen now is every Where's single my... channel that hit 1 million subscribers I'm not even on that list, come on guys. Holy crap! My editor didn't feel like typing them all out, so here's just a video of me scrolling through the Excel sheet. Each one of these names represents someone that hits a million subscribers in just 2020. Now to wrap things up, I have a fishbowl full of random small channels. I'm going to draw a channel like this, and give them a plug. So Amelia and Birdie, shout out to you. You'll be linked in Dude, the description Dude, imagine below. if I got I called out. That, that would be I crazy. I don't think it'll happen, but honest, imagine. I only know how to speak English. So it's kind of hard for me to include you guys, but uh, shout out to, how do you say this? Soyan Osman. Soyan Osman with 241 subscribers. Shout out to you. I want to also give a quick shout out to PewDiePie. My rewind was heavily inspired by his rewind that he did in years past. And I even used the same editor as he did. Felix, nice. I love you. Thank you so much for the inspiration. If you're not already subscribed to him, you yeah, subscribe already. to PewDiePie. And our final I mean, shout out of the rewind, Nalter Deeds with 1,400 subscribers. Make sure you subscribe to all three of the small creators. I thought it'd be a Oh, I didn't win, guys. I'm so sure subscribe to me to help support me, so okay? Please watching. subscribe. Oh! Shameless plug. Oh, that's hot. Oh, hey, that was, uh... <laughs> oh my god, what was that? That was, uh... Shoot. Why am I blanking here? Fortnite. So that was the thing you can see, I mean, good vibes, right? Obviously there was bad things that happened, but there's a lot of good things in terms of content creation and people coming together. All right, so let's go back and try to break down some of this stuff. PewDiePie, Mass KSI, just messing John. Jeffree Star, Ethan, Ethan had a lot of drama, Corpse, Valkyrie. So the whole dream drama, right? So let's get into this dream drama. If you don't know, the reason dreams been talked a lot here and he talked about it at the end was, um, I think he went from like, I can't remember his subscriber count, but it was really small. He got super huge. He has like 40, actually, let me look this up right now. Cause I don't want to like get this wrong. He has 15 million subscribers, right? He went from like small number. He just like blew up like crazy. He did all these Minecraft speed runs, right? And there was a lot of drama that surrounded it. Cause people were like, He's cheating, he's doing all this stuff because there's no way you can get that consistent speed runs because it's like luck drop based. So people were like saying his runs were fake, all this stuff. Hey, this guy's a great big phony. So that's kind of why he's a huge deal. Not only because he gained all the subscribers, but also because some people were calling him a fake. So that was a big thing with Dream. That's why he's referenced multiple times in here. Keanu, you're beautiful. That's, and then and then that, that's just a quick aside there because obviously it's not just about America, but the most humiliating debate in all of history, potentially. I, The whole world is laughing other than us Americans who are just like... Which is why I called hundreds of YouTubers and asked them what they think... So Belle Delphine, everyone. huge, what past couple years, years, James Charles, big. A lot of these people. Some of them I don't Minecraft. know. This year was a big year for Minecraft. I love you. It was a huge year for Minecraft, which is crazy. Because it was like Minecraft was a big thing and then it kind of dropped off. Then it was a big thing again, then it dropped off. And now it's a big thing again, along with Among Us and Fall Guys were probably the other two big games I would say that this year that everyone kind of focused around. But Fall Guys, Fall Guys was like there and then it was gone in like two weeks, so. <laughs> I 
deleted a channel of mine. Oh yeah, deleted a channel, that's right. I never actually watched their channel, but I did hear about that big news. They deleted a channel and everyone like lost their minds. It was something where like they said that they were gonna do it, but then when they did it, everyone was like, I can't believe you've done this. I can't believe you've done this. Black Lives, Black Lives Matter Matters Matters. happened this year. A lot of crazy stuff happened around that, obviously. It doesn't really talk too much about like events, but I remember seeing some other like 2020 rewind by somebody else. And it was talking about how like the forest fires in Australia happened this year. The whole World War III thing was gonna happen. So all those things happened this year and they haven't talked about that. So that's something to think about. So while, you know, like there's a lot of bad stuff that happened and we couldn't really connect, you know, in person, people had to like kind of stay home. There was a lot of good stuff that happened. There's a lot of people connecting through the internet, through social media, influencers connecting. People came together so while 2020 was pretty rough, um, just try to think of some good things that happened too, okay? And just kind of reflect on those things as well instead of just thinking about the bad things that might have happened to you in 2020. And with that, I will see you guys next time.